My excitement about getting the Rex01 can't be understated. As we showed in the unboxing, A-Rex looks to have provided a very well-made and feature-rich product at a price that beats the competition for those wanting a single-action, double-action, duty-sized gun. We took it out to our shooting spot for groupings of 7 yards. Eric had the honors of first shots. have the Rex Zero One by A Rex. Um, not a bad gun. It's a little bit wide for my hand, both um, width here and then width here makes things a little bit difficult to get to. Um, I know it does have the dual-sided or ambidextrous mag release, which still is a little bit. Um, I can get it there, but definitely can't get it on the other side. Um, can't really get to the slide release either, um, but not a bad trigger. It's a little squishy up front, but the reset's nice, and uh, overall, it's going to get the job done. All right, the uh, Airx Rex Zero One um, is a broad gun. Some might even call it fat, but uh, for large hands like mine, it fits quite comfortably, thanks to the reliefs that are on the sides of the grips. I pointed out in the unboxing video. The trigger does have a little bit of initial squish, as Erica pointed out, but the reset is nice and clear. We can see it's, the firearm is clear. I'll demonstrate this real quick. So you pull. Fires, action works, and that reset is very audible and definitive. Then you have a little more take up again and a break. Makes for a very comfortable, predictable follow up shot. Just as I remembered from Shot Show, excellent accuracy with a trigger that balances the line between range and duty use. The Rex 01 may be broad in the hand, but only because they packed it with so many things to like.